Should be a way to Corral's office through those pipes on the left. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. I think he's still processing. This kid definitely knows her way around tech. Huh? No, I ain't impressed. I'm uh, reluctantly acknowledging. Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Okay, Drax is clearly on to something, so let's all just go with that. That Nikki is too smart to be your daughter. That Nikki is too smart to be your daughter. Whatever it takes to get out of this. You're really gonna be one of those dads? No, that's not what I... That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. So much for your girlfriend meeting us. It did seem unlikely. All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. Being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just. We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. Next stop, Corral's office. Come on. Just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's got to be eating at you. Some need many years to fully comprehend their paternal responsibility. None of this changes who I am. I'm still cool as a cucumber. Groot says all the cucumbers he's ever met were terrified on the inside. Well, that don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. Hello? Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. There are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer. See if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says... Mother knows best. Return, hope, promise. Any luck getting in? The thing's pretty well protected. I need time. All right, let me know. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. Healing. The resemblance is uncanny. She doesn't look anything like me. She's blue. Besides, why wouldn't Corral have just told me? Protect her daughter, Peter Quill. Copulating with you was a capital offense under the Cree purity laws. That's not a real thing, is it? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. So, when Corel said we shouldn't be doing this... He was being literal. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree purity laws. From a legal perspective, copulating with you is extremely objectionable. From other perspectives, too. Oh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Kree are involved in any of this? 
The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging from a wall. This must be Corel's first kid. I remember she talked about him a lot. He was on Hala, right? When the Shatari... Yeah. Her kid and her husband. Explains how fearless she was during the war. She had nothing to lose. Corel had a real artistic side to her. She was the only Kree I ever knew who painted and played music. I used to think it was a sign of weakness, but... No. It's a strength. Definitely a sign of strength. Some kind of dye machine. Is it normal for Kree to dye their hair? Not unless they're hiding something. Oh, wow! The Kree have comic books? I am surprised. The Kree Council is very strict on approved forms of entertainment. So this could be, like, super valuable then. How valuable are we talking? Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Oh, oh crap. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop. As it is large, we must break it! Is this thing what made all those Nova Corps go crazy? Still seems like there's so much we don't know! We need to get to the Nexus! So we're all thinking that Raker's Church is definitely involved! Mechanical beast is running out of limbs! How is he still standing? Any last words? For future reference, you guys really need to work on yourselves! I for one can turn the violent path! I've never been as intrigued by a church as no I am right mercy. now! I do not find it particularly appealing! Man, that giant robot can take a lot of pain! It is as venerable as it is large! We must break it! We must tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest! I am Groot, 
Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? I can't just plug servers into my skull. I still need a central terminal. You said the bridge was on the other side of that corridor. So we just gotta make our way across and then up somehow. So, how do we get across? Peter's the one with the visor. Unless he broke it. I didn't break it. It's weird, right? How the world mine seems to have gone completely dark? Very weird. Perhaps it is rebooting. Of all the words you could have used there, Drax, that one actually wasn't too bad. Thank you. It was either that or reloading. That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. I am Groot. How am I supposed to know why the boot ain't picking up? Keep trying. never understood how so much information could be stored in such a magical way. Okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the road in? No! Come on! <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. Dog report item. We have encountered a formidable new enemy. Still no sign of the ghosts. He didn't mean literal ghosts. Ghosts in the system. Remnants of data. Uh, let it go. Just let him think there are ghosts. to get into some of these servers. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panicked scampering is what caused the final break. Your oversized gut is what caused the first 50 breaks! Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the Nexus control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the Nexus. Then we're in! You're kidding. Well, yes! Guys, we're in! I am cold. Gotta be something in here. Isn't that the mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone? Yeah. What is the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral. Found something. After we left. Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. <laughs> no, you're a lotus scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. Gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. 
The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. All right, let's take a look. I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocols. It's called stupidity, Drax. Something the Buckethead's got a lot of. I was wondering how they knew about us. Quill must have tripped the sensors on the way out. Isn't that the mining rig from the quarantine zone? Oh, great. Looks like your girlfriend was collecting evidence against us even after the two of you struck a deal. Wow, super riveting, Quill. And to think we could still be reading my criminal record. They can't be that scary if they share a record. <laughs> I've heard of this guy. He's part of a private army called the Lethal Legion. <laughs> More like the Loser Legion. What is it with you, Humies, and your stupid names? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Star-Lord is not in the same league as Darkhawk, okay? One's the name of the greatest band of all time, and the other's a bird. So, Drax's criminal record is pretty big. That is what your mother said. <laughs> it's great, because his mother's dead. I thought there'd be more here. Barely scratches the surface. I am Groot. You? <laughs> A gold dome? Over my dead body, buddy. You know, for a non-spacefaring species, us humans sure get around. Hey, isn't that the guy we saw when we tried to pay our fine? Yeah, that's him. Look, it's Jax's girlfriend. Lady Hellbender is not my girlfriend. Yet. Why does this guy seem familiar? Grand Unifier Raker. Wonder what he was looking for in the quarantine zone. Probably nothing good. Read it and weep, losers. There ain't a single scam me and Groot haven't pulled off. You name it, we've done it. If you're charged, it means you've been caught. Wow, your record's a lot bigger than I expected. How big were you expecting? Minuscule. Another guy from Earth. I am unfamiliar with this Kree. Uh. Check it out. Nikki's got a file. Boring. I have heard of this one. Agent of Thanos. Get to the juicy stuff already. Guardians of the galaxy. You misread our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices. I had to check. Groot, write the stars. <laughs> Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. Rejoice. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you.
not so we're stuck here. Hey, at least the dumb guys let us keep our weapons. They demonstrate their lack of fear. It was a proven battle tactic. Katathian warriors often ride into battle completely naked. Keep your pants on. Although it could be used as a distraction. Yeah, no. Any other ideas? Can you froth? I can froth. Can you twitch? Yeah, I'm pretty twitchy. All right. On my cue, you drop, froth, and twitch. While they're all distracted, we take off down one of them side holes. What about me? You, well, you know, you, uh, take one for the team. I'm not gonna... Walk with me! Come on, Quill, just grab your chest and drop. Find another plan. So, the matriarch asked for us by name? You, specifically. Although I cannot fathom why. Peter is constantly surprising us, too. But if he's first in line for brainwashing, I gotta say... Is that what you think? That we're brainwashing? We've met your recent converts. Overly zealous doesn't even begin to describe They me. have embraced the Matriarch's promise. A life-altering experience, yes. But one that must be freely accepted. Quill, his drone. It's your ticket out of here. What? How? What are you two whispering about? Well? He wants to know if you know you're the bad guy. Reductive concepts like good and bad led us into the Galactic War. Uh, actually, we were just admiring how huge this place is. It is grand, isn't it? Belief in the Matriarch restored it to what it was before the war. Just as her promise will restore everyone we lost. Mothers, lovers, sons. This promise will raise the dead? Of course it won't. We can't bring people back. We can't. But the matriarch, the divine vessel. I got an idea, but I need time. Stall him. Intended to kill you. Wow. Oh, oh, okay. That. Uh, that is a cool trick. Want to explain how you did it? Sorcery. I can understand how some might see it that way, but I used science. The science of faith. Faith is not science. But faith energy is. This skiff. My inquisitors. Even Sacrosanct herself. All powered by the same miraculous energy. Energy I discovered. I'm going for the drone. Keep him talking. What now? What? What is it? It's just, um. You, uh, you, uh, discovered stuff, and you claim to, uh, control energy? Faith energy? Right. Uh, well, it just seems like all this, uh... I, I think what Gamora's point is, is, um, you say you have all of this energy. Faith energy. Right, but when we first saw you... Weren't you stranded on Hallis Hope because your shuttle ran out of juice? Yes, I was, but... So why don't you just believe that your ship had more gas? It doesn't work that way. Faith energy is a byproduct of belief. Focused belief. <laughs> okay, sure. I saw this proven. Focused belief in him is what enabled us to survive. So, you were saying... Wait. Weren't there more of you? What? No, no, no. <laughs> no, nope. Nope. It seems like the kind of thing that we would be aware of. Indeed. Please, continue your 
fascinating encounter. What did you mean when you said them just now? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? And could you maybe talk some more about it? I was talking about him. The healer who could not reverse the death of my son! <laughs> you! Get off that now. Back with the others. What? I was just admiring... Silence! It's time to meet the Matriarch. So, we gotta summon the Milano. No! If you kept Grand Unicorn talking, I could have answered that. Now we gotta look for a comm relay station. Ridiculous. The ship is exceptionally spacious. Yeah, well, maybe we can ask Will's girlfriend for directions after she's warped our brains. Come on! What? I'm just saying what we're all thinking. The Guardians of the Galaxy. Thank you, Grand Unifier. Guardians, we may approach. Peter Quill, order your offspring to come down from there this instant. Maybe I'm out of line, but aren't you a little young for a dress that short? Aren't you a little old to write your name on your clothes? Uh. Took you long enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, chatty grandpa gets. Hey, we're gonna get you out of here. Just follow my lead. But this is where we're supposed to be. We're gonna save everybody. I'm gonna save them, I promised. Come on, snap out of it, kid. You're just saying what he wants you to say. Whoa, whoa, hold on, everybody! The just... girl is clearly not herself. Of course I am. But I'm more than just me. Where's your mom? Mom is here. She's right here. Inside me. Oh, thanks for clearing that up. The light... joined us. I thought she was gone. But I can bring her back. They're all waiting... for us to bring them back. All we need... is faith. The Grand Unifier helped me understand. This is one big con. Trust me, I know a thing or two about- Why can't you just believe in me? Why won't you just listen? Nobody ever listens until I show them.
Mom, what, what's going on? How, how is this possible? You saved me. That's how. I knew you would never leave me. I, I, I didn't. I mean... Look at you. Look at you, all grown up. And into the great leader I knew you would become. <laughs> Peter, I am so proud of you. Your father would be so proud. I, I, I don't understand. I... I saw you die. Am I... Did I go back? You are here. That's all that matters. We have all the time in the world now. You and me. And your friends, too. My friends? Sure. The house is plenty big enough. And I want to meet this amazing team of yours and hear all about your incredible adventures. <laughs> <laughs> that is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart, I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, let go of me. Stop. I can't believe I have you back. Seriously, Mom. I can't believe I have... Please, let go of me. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, Mom, you're squeezing kind of tight. We have so much time to make up. Maybe we'll... That was a little loose. Shouldn't be the cause of the problem, though. I guess that needs replacing. Plugs are like new, so that's not the problem. Hmm. Might need to top off the oil. Yeah, be right there, Mom. Meredith Quill, where do you keep your carving knives? Oh, there's one in the drawer, nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. There you are, Peter. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Peter Quill. Your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures. She also told us she had found a suitable mate for you. But you refused to see reason. Drax, you said that would stay between us. We've only been on Earth for half a day, Mom, and you're already playing matchmaker? I've waited this long, Chris. Haven't you told her about me? She is Peter Quill's illegitimate daughter, your illegitimate granddaughter. Uh, I was trying to find the right time to tell you? Why do I feel like I'm about to get grounded? I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart. I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe. Let go of me. Stop. 
I can't believe I have you back. Seriously, Mom. Stop <laughs> hugging me. Peter. It's okay. It's me. How you... Peter, what are you doing? I'm sorry. I don't understand. I love you. Of course. This isn't right. Please. You have to trust me. Taking this off or hanging it up. Finally! I need your help. Mom will be home for lunch soon, and I want everything to be perfect. Perfect? For her birthday. That's today. Did you forget again? Dad? Uh, honestly, kinda. Are you kidding? Dad! You promised you'd help me surprise Mom for her birthday. I, I did? Yes! You said you'd help fix the hollow projector, and the cake still needs candles, and I can't find the present we got her. Right. Oh, wow. This looks amazing. Did you make it? Oh, no. I ordered it from the bakery planet. There's a bake? No! I baked it. Okay, that just le- Hmm. Uh, Nick? Is it supposed to be fuzzy? Uh, obviously not. It's not focused right or something. Can you refocus it? Wow. It turned out so good. I was sure I messed part of it up. Wait, did you make this? Yeah. It's hollow and the star system around it, and I think I got all the moons. It's beautiful. Just need mom's present now. I think it's somewhere in my room. Don't forget the present! Hey, hey! You still have Chewie? Yeah, he's captain of the Milano now. Really? Oh, congrats, I guess. I don't I remember this. Did you find it? Yeah. Okay, put it with the others. Great, a gift. Put it on the table. One birthday present. What did you get her? We got it. On Nowhere. Remember that artist alley we went to and the painting she really liked? Of Krilar? Oh. Right. Yeah. Anything else? I don't think so. How does it look? Amazing. Your mom's gonna love it. Thanks, Dad. I love you. Uh, wow. <laughs> okay, I, uh... Nikki? Why is the door locked? It's ma'am. I'll make sure everything's perfect. You get the door. Surprise! Peter? What are you two? No! no! <clears throat> Don't believe it, Peter. This isn't real. 
She's being tricked. She never should have been here. What she saw. I don't know how, but the three of us are connected now. That thing, that thing has her, but she can still be saved. She has to accept my death. She must. Show her how to let me go. Free my daughter. Save her. out of here! Now! By rejecting the promise, you have proven yourselves unworthy. And you must be destroyed! No! This is wrong! What did you do to us? Spark and mind games! I'm gonna feel you later! Focus on Raker! Here's your chance to save a woman in need, Squirrel! Deep breaths! Help is on the way! Ah, this hole will not break so easily! Remember? Whereas me, I don't need to take sides to mow anybody down. I just love making scumbusters go boom! Okay, okay, I get it. Those creeps out there, fighting them gets the blood pumping. Oh yeah. But if you listen to that pumping too hard, your heart takes a dive and the losing starts. Stay on target and we'll make them all go boom. Who's with me? Wise words, Peter Yes! Time to... Kimura, cut him down! Can't tell if they feel pain, but I know when they feel dead! Re 
easy targets down here. How do we get out? You should have bought me more time with that drone. Now we gotta go in blind and hope we can find a comm center to call the Milano. We'll figure it out. Anybody see a way up? I see a way up. How thoughtful. Bad. We need an exit! There ain't one! Then Warp drive coolant. We can't just jump in there. We need to keep moving. Maybe I wasn't clear. That's a pool of instant death. Whoa! Whoa. Tracks! Tracks, man. Uh, everything okay? Yes. Okay, so maybe it ain't warp drive coolant. <laughs> That's tingly. Well. We need to talk about your kid trying to kill us. Raker did something to her. This is his... Do you think we reached the old mining sector? No. The Grand Unifier sent Lictor drones into the lower halls. The heretics would have been disintegrated. Scott Halls? Yeah, maybe. But if we are lost, at least they can't find us. We're screwed. We're lost and we're screwed. I just need to get my bearings. I ain't never been on a ship this big. Scott, what are they doing? Blocking our way forward. So many doors. You do know the way out, right? I would have if you guys bought me more time with that drone. It's gotta be through one of them doors. Which one? Well, you know it ain't the one we just came through. Are you kidding me? Okay, we got this. Hey, look! These idiots don't see us yet. No time to stand around fighting these dudes. The faster we get out, the faster we save Nick. Are any of these tools? This is what happens when you let miners build. 
Dead end. Now what? Up there! That cat walks our way out. If we can get across that gap. Fuck. We got a bigger problem. Drone's back. Quill, find us a way up to that catwalk before we're extra crispy. That Drax, push that across the gap. Yes. No, 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 no! Wrong way, Drax! What the Scott, man? Drax! What? That headed for Doom? That was our. Doesn't matter. Got an exit. Let's go. Well, that thing really wants a piece of you. Too bad they're my pieces. We should keep moving. <laughs> this doesn't look good, Peter. Whoa. Is this some kind of torture chamber? Hey, uh, are you okay? I might as well be back on Half World. Some of my fellow experiments bought into this kind of scut. The Kree scientists told them we were chosen, and they tailed the snout believed it, even as they were dying. But you didn't. I was one of the smart ones. Me and... Uh... Stand looking. Let's get the flark out of here. I've had enough of this nightmare. Tell me we're close to your comm center. Maybe I'd have an answer if you people hadn't botched my plan. So, that's a no. Big ship like this has got to have multiple comm centers. We'll find one. I hope. Gonna put a bullet in one of these markers for every people battery in this place. That's a lot of bullets. I got enough. Broke another culture! Have you fun praying on the week? Make them hurt, Gamora! This ship is a nightmare factory! Sleep is overrated anyways. Less time to think about wasting scut holes like me! Magic. Yeah, yeah, just let me do it. Am 
must be the comm relay. Hard to get off this heap. So, uh, how long is this gonna take? I'm gonna need your help. Sure. All right. Just stand right here. Okay. Perfect. <sighs> Why are we pretending we did not witness what we witnessed in the ceremonial chamber? Because the promise is an insidious lie. How can you be certain? Because I wanted to believe it, but I knew when I woke up it... <sighs> We'll all be gone. What did you see? I... am Groot. I saw my mom. Life. But there was something else there, too. A shadow. Yeah, exactly. Whatever it is, it's using the girl. Probably fed her alive her own. About Karat. I know, she's. The rocket sky dog! What? That was completely intentional. The Milano's on her way. Thanks, bud. All right, let's split before the Faith Brigade realizes what we did. Where's the Milano supposed to dock? <laughs> It's cute they use the word dock. She doesn't have hangar clearance, so we're gonna have to get creative. Okay, just don't go overboard. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found a rendezvous spot near the hull. Peter, there's a workbench we can use. Better safe than sorry. Let's get it done. All right. Really? Nothing at all? All right. Now let's get out of here while we still can. Ugh. We need to get through here, but the stupid Faith Tech door ain't powered. So how do we charge it? Gotta find something compatible with that power port. Maybe I can just zap it? Runs on faith. Got a lazy death bot here. This battery might still have some juice. Whoa! Whoa! <sighs> Not cool! Do you know what you're doing? Sure. Battery in the battery slot, right? Will this work? One way to find out. Hook it up! Looks like it worked! Somebody want to fetch the destroyer? Drax, you coming, man? Drax? Hello? Hey, Drax. What's wrong? It has occurred to me that this may be nothing more than a lingering dream. It's not, I promise. But we need to go. Very well. Just... not now, bud. What is that? <laughs> yeah, that is kind of scary. I've never heard any ship make that noise. Not even Jatari. Is that... singing? More like distant chanting. Whatever it is, that's a lot of people. We have to go this way. Our luck's gotta change. I mean, once you shoot your own mom in the face, things have to go up from there, right? <laughs> Peter, you know none of that was real. Flock, whatever that is, it's really close. Millions of them. At least. I am 
fruit. Yeah, and how are we supposed to help? We need to worry about getting our own tails off this death trap. We survive. Then we make sure Cosmo knows everything about this nightmare. He'll know what to do. Our church comes for us! Flark! Think we can hijack that skiff? Probably. It'll be an ugly hack. Safety's off, people! I'm surprised your gun even has a safety! Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! Crew, snag up! Keep her still, Rocket! This is accelerating! Return to the ship. There is work to be done. Yeah, that's kind of the goal here. Good. Okay, let's see what we can do with this gun. Come on. Come on. You sure you can? Whoa! If just one small faith battery can power one of their robots, imagine the power they harness here. And they're conquering planets now. Even this is small scale. Did you hear that? Hear what? There was... Whoa! We're okay. They're just bouncing off the field.
taking too long. There's our ride. Come on. We can agree this is probably the church's capital ship, right? Sure looks like it. And we know they have the rock and all the ships docked there. There's no end to them! Rocky, can you outrun them? How? We've got the same skiff! Crap, the shield's blow! You gotta keep them off of us! They're trying to distract us! The war can come! It's gonna cost them!
Star Lord says. There he is. I'm going after Raker. Don't follow. What? Demora! Uh, Trust me, Peter. Uh oh. We got another Scott ton of goons coming our way. It. He is free of his madness now! Don't be sad! Keep hunting, they're scudding lights out! It's a crazy girl, She just ran off! She knows what she's doing! Making sure work of these caucus creeps! Stop that weirdo, deserve it! Coach is choosing his team members! Look! The sorcerer heals his ilk! What are you, Crax? Going to be tricky without Gamora! He will return! Groot, try the passport again, just in case. What did he say? He says he has been, but it still don't work. Me and that dog are gonna have words. Groot, do your thing. Yeah, what happens if Gamora don't catch up? Once they realize we're on the Milano, both the floor! How's that thing still dogging us? Run! Go! I hate everything in this ship! Go, go, go! Jump! What? Jump! We need to keep moving forward, well... Blitz of rocket! You're a big guy! There's too many of them! Let's take the elevator! You're all charged up! Should get here any tick now. Should? Yeah, well, it's the best I can do. And our window to meter is getting smaller. You know they're gonna open fire as soon as they do. Guys, huddle up! I know! It's like they want me to keep blowing them up. And I gotta admit, every time they go splat, it paints an awfully nice picture. <laughs> There's no way we lose today, Quill. Okay, look. We just need to show some backbone here. The backbone is showing. No, no. I, I mean, we've got more power and speed than these goons, so there's no need to be afraid of them. Who's with me? I feel Way to kill the mood. Fuck it! Fireworks! Root! Slow him down! Broke another cultist! These deluded souls do not know when to quit! Toss him around! Love it out of big guy! Throw that, Drax! These deluded souls do not know when to quit! Bumps away, Rocket! 
Launch it, Drax!
must go back. Are you crazy? I like killing sprees as much as the next guy, but we barely got out of there alive. What about Gamora? She, she made a choice. So you're just gonna abandon her? And Nikki? What if it was Groot? You gonna leave him behind too? I am Groot. Don't talk like that. That's not what this is about. Isn't it though? We're supposed to be a team. Teams don't leave people behind. Tell that to the giant Kratakan army of robots and brainwashed believers we barely got away from! Gamora! Is that...? Yes. How'd you get back? It doesn't matter. I failed. Raker lives. For now. We have to go back. We can't leave Nikki there. What he'll turn her into. Blah, blah, flark and blah. So you got stepdaddy issues and had a horrible childhood. Ooh, rocket! What? It's true. Guess what? You ain't the only one here who had it bad. It don't mean we're angling to commit suicide because some pseudo priest nutjob is doing surprise nutjob stuff. If we go back there, we're dead. D E D, dead. I'd rather die with honor than without. Crawled up her butt and died. I am good. So, get the Flark out of Dodge? Not yet. You should try to get a hold of Cosmo instead. I am good. Great plan, only he ain't answering the passport. Okay, but what choice do we have? We don't have comms. Well, actually, we uh, might have comms. It turns out they weren't as Flarked as I originally thought. Really? Groot should be able to race. Okay. Sounds like Murder Mom's feeling more stabby than usual. Hey! Better not slice through anything in that cargo bay. We ain't restocking anytime soon. I am Groot. Harsh. Excuse me, I ain't the one advocating. Chew, chew, move over. What are you looking at? Oh no, you ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship? Chew, flark off! Wow, that panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't. Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy. Where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Pyotr Quill. Cosmo's ball has been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. What? Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. He's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet, this problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable to get through. Guardian of Galaxies must actually. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? Are we under attack? So these are the cowards who defile Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flock are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory. 
leader of the Lethal Legion. <laughs> a Lethal Legion? Uh, more like Loser Legion. <laughs> He's surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. Lady Hellbender sends her regards, so-called Guardians of the Galaxy. Prepare to be eliminated. No, you prepare to be eliminated. <laughs> Smooth. Uh, we got this. Probably. <sighs> Hard and give no quarter. There's nothing on that garbage scow worth salvaging. Groot, find us a channel with less butthole content. The Flarkers are forcing it open somehow. Feel free to pat it. You're... Got a piece of that guy. I am Groot. Stop barking orders, Groot. You don't even know how to fly her. I would love to hunt you down. Private Morning Glory is running his mouth again. Feels kind of good to have bounty hunters after us. It means we're making a name for ourselves, right? Not sure how much we get out of taking down crappy crap hole and his legion of crap. Oh, Hang in there, bud. They ain't killed us yet. Ain't dying fast enough. That's a fixable problem. Jeez, how much money did she offer these guys? Doesn't matter. She wasted her money. Feel free to show off, Quill. They insulted my baby. Just keep watching. We just send an IOU to Lady A. Only one lethal lame brain left. One is all we need. That don't even make sense. We just wasted a ton of you. Woo! <laughs> Who's the inferior life form now, huh? Still you. Peter, I'm picking up something. What? It appears I'll have to finish this myself. So you defeated my fighters. My cruiser will crush you. That's it? That's what you've been bragging about? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's fun. I'm sure it's very comfortable. I will not be mocked! Then do something about it. That did some real damage. Keep hitting his exhaust ports. Your strategy will work. Thanks. You just confirmed that it will. Lady Skull shoot us the worst flock in timing! Is she here? Buster Goons! This time! You know that, Guardians? Nope, not a thing. The Milano definitely felt it. Starting to feel like we pissed off the whole galaxy. A good chunk of them anyway. Really need to work on our PR. Keep up the barrage. They will not survive it. It's really pissing me off. Showing us up, Quill.
Take that, Lady Skull Scut! I doubt we've seen the last of her. We won't worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. Punch it! Yep. Old girl needs a tune-up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no buckethead near my... Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open a channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. These ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous dome heads, but they're they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flarkin' deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. <sighs> Welcome to Nova Corps headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. Groot. I know, bud, but now we can all follow along with Starpan's mistakes. How may we assist you? We should report what Raker is up to. Think the Flarkin world mind doesn't already know? Maybe not oh, everything. Flark you! We, we are, are aware of the current threat, but can devote no, no resources toward fighting it. Just pick something, Peter. After scanning your ship, our near-perfect algorithms pre-selected several officer choices. Centurion Corel's personal communicator has either been destroyed or disabled, and could not be reached. For what it's worth, I'm sorry, Quill. Me too. How about future crime? Great idea! Let's report something we're gonna do, and blame it on some other schmuck. Thank, Thank you. you for being proactive. However, the galaxy's impending doom makes all future crimes irrelevant. We should tell them about the promise. Connecting to banking services. I can't believe that worked. Guardians of the galaxy. Explain yourselves. Hey, world mind. Long time no see. It's me, Peter Quill, Star Lord. And, uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. galaxy. cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the Promise is sweeping, sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than, than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts. Worlds and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda, Andromeda galaxy, galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually, the world mine is a collective consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me in it. I'm Groot. Look, we just escaped the Church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well... How to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Nova Corps helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? 
They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. Th the point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Xandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Xandarian culture is a lost cause. Culture is more than a location. And yet, after the Shatari attack, you still build the new Xandar in the same system, knowing it wasn't safe. But you're Nova Corps' leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That, that is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads. We do, we do not, not have a duty to protect this galaxy. We, we merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only ourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. directive. We have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The, the risk, risk is too great. It, it would be, be a pointless, pointless sacrifice. sacrifice. Unknown reasons. The church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We, we cannot, cannot adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If, if the power, power source cannot be quantified, it, it cannot be countered. countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Ha! Drax, he's as dumb as a stick and he ain't failed so far. Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Corps? It... It's not magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. It exists because we exist. And we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Raker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the church does. Perhaps. You, you have, have given us new data to consider. Guardians of the galaxy, we will. Later. Right now, we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did we not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Alan Warlock, the Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, no Guardians. Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline still asking for fine money. <sighs> All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on the Nova Corps fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. 
I'm Groot. They're taking off. Chomp Quill. I know. Those promises becoming real. Peter? Gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! Scott! Whoa! What the flark did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The Loser Legion must have hit something when they ambushed her. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Guys. And how are we gonna do that? We're dead in the flock and water. And if they find us, we're screwed. Freely accepted. Oh, oh yeah, and without an engine, we're screwed. Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys! Enough! Just stop already! I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just... can't do this right now. I need some rest. Screw Nova Corps. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> 